Hey everybody, so another day, another place. Today we're in Wears Valley and we're gonna hit a couple places as time allows. It's kind of late in the day. Um, first thing I, I wanted to mention was I have my new shirt on, Roscoe's Treasures. I wanna have Steph show you the back. <laughs> Get my hair out of the way. Sweet, honey, sweet. Sweet, sweet t-shirt. Anyway, we're starting this off across the road from goats, the goats on a goats on a roof and the goat coaster, and they have these. It's a brand new putt putt golf course with dinosaurs. No, it's not a. Well, I guess they do have a, a putt putt. Yeah, but the uh, yeah you know, the mountain coaster over there is pretty cool, and uh, it's we're, all pretty cool. We're Outside Pigeon Forge, we're just leaving Pigeon Forge. Yep, so our first stop though, even though we're at Stephanie's favorite antique mall. It's my favorite. We're gonna stop and check out this. I don't remember this little place here. And we're gonna go see if they're open. I think they are. So follow us. So our first stop was gonna be this general store. It says they're closed for vacation, reopening Saturday, March 2nd. So we'll be back Saturday, March 2nd or somewhere thereabout to check this out. Uh, boo, they're not open. That's okay, we, now we get to head right over to my favorite antique mall. It was one of the first places we visited when we started coming here yep. to um, Tennessee for vacation. Uh, eight years ago now, 10 years ago, something, something like that. Like that. And I did want to note that inside of this antique mall, they have a 50s style diner that has floats, sundaes, burgers, fries, hot dogs, that kind of stuff. We've never eaten in there. Um, and we won't be eating in there today because we have different plans for dinner, so. So I'm gonna check out the diner first, just because I think it's really cool. So there's the menu and open 11 to five. They also have to go orders here. used to have this car I don't know if my parents will remember that but it's a radio yeah I used to have that well, I'm sure a lot of people used to have one of these $189 for that belt and guns of course they're play guns not real ones but this place is packed with the antiques lots and lots of them we got an Indian chief in here, $995. All this Pillsbury Doughboy stuff. I don't think I've ever seen so much Pillsbury Doughboy. Pop over place, that's funny. If, if only. You don't see prices like that anymore, or ever again. So we just got done 
in this uh, sweet little antique mall and I'm looking specifically for some corn cob pipes. Don't yeah. ask me why, I have a plan. And that, that was a complete no-go. They didn't have any any pipes at all in they there. They had one of everything else, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, yep. Yeah, there's a lot. Now the music was really loud in there playing 50s music. But I mean, it kind of sets the theme, I guess. Yeah, it's fun. It's um, jam-packed of collectibles and antiques. Right. So we want to... We're going to, actually, I was going to thank you all for watching, but we're not done yet. We're going to go on out Wears Valley and see what else we can see. Oh, okay. Follow us again. <laughs> this will be our last stop here in Wears Valley for today. Um, there's a lot more to hit in this area, and we'll do that coming up in the next couple weeks, maybe. But uh, we wanted to check out this Whaley's Country Store. They have Amish goods, which were originally from Amish Country. And uh, so let's go see if they've got some seltzers Lebanon. Yeah, some bologna or some barbecue chips. Middlesworth barbecue. They do have firewood, which $3.99 a bundle. I guess it's five dollars after hours, so but they do have that here. Of course you can get your ice. And hot cider. I mean who doesn't like hot cider? So they got your cool little candles. Almost like a grocery store kind of feel. Or camp store for sure. Yeah, yeah, that's a better. All kind of cool sodas. You got knee high in there, sun drop. Some I've never heard of. They do have Pennsylvania Dutch birch beer. It's a good sign. Yeah. Pretty good stuff if you've never had it. They have cheer wine. That's another good one. A little bit of produce. And actually, the tomatoes look pretty good. That's... I like milk. And, uh, and they do have seltzer's bologna here. So, hallelujah, praise Jesus. <laughs> they have the different seasonings and spices. We have Martin's chips. And the Walnut Creek chips are pretty good. I've had them. But no Middlesworth. Then they have the different jams and jellies. See that at a lot of places here. And they got the honey and canned peaches, the cobbler mix, pie filling, different pickles and stuff. And then they have apple butter, which if I get apple butter, I have to go to uh, the apple barn. For sure. Yeah, and, and Pigeon Forge. And they got some of the older candy here. They have a lot of the old timer candy. There's a whole candy row over here left. Yeah, we're going to take a look at that here in a minute. Yeah, the old candy sticks. And look, only 35 cents a piece. That's good. You and I were just talking about some Pop Rocks. Yeah, I'm never, I've never been a fan. And Zagnuts. That's, that's my favorite candy bar. Yep, that it is. Ever. Stephanie's favorite. <laughs> and then I got some pottery, stuffed animals. And then... Some more of the candy and the little containers. And brooms are pretty cool. And we weren't, originally weren't far from Hershey. There's Hershey chocolate bars in here. Everything for, to make s'mores. 
even the little roasting forks different popcorns a lot of really cool stuff and here they have candy that you can grab and weigh and Stephanie didn't see the root beer barrels she likes them so I, ha I had to get a bag of their barbecue chips it's not middle's worth no but the walnut creek chips their yeah. barbecue chips are pretty well, good you know what you like yes and they did have the seltzers baloney but i am not paying ten dollars for not even a pound of it so um but we have found it before out on our out on our ventures yep and um we have to travel a little bit further to get it but um, that's oh, well. what that's the life of you taking <laughs> you get take some and leave some that's it so we want to thank everybody for watching um, if you like this video please like and subscribe hit the little bell ding ling 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 and that'll notify you the next time we post and until next time have, have a, a Stephanie day, day.